Hello, welcome to the channel. Today we'll draw this pattern free card using the love tool. So first let's create new file, clicking this icon, switch to part design or bench, and here create body, create sketch in XY plane. Go to sketch geometries and here select the rounded rectangle tool and draw this rectangle. So now select this tool symmetrical constraint and select this point and this point and now this origin point okay so now select this tool and click in this arc and change the radius of to 10 press ok now select this horizontal distance tool change the length to 6 and now pick this tool vertical distance select this line and change it to 6 and now close the sketch okay press home go to combo view and here click in model and now select this sketch and right click on mouse and choose this option rename this sketch and the name of this sketch will be section okay and now select this section sketch again and click on mouse and go to copy option and here we select only this this sketch section click ok and now click in this icon and pass this section three times One, two, three. okay so now select this sketches and drag it to body so clicking the second sketch and click on mouse and go to attachment the detail here we change the z duration to 10 click ok and now go to this section 2 and click on mouse and go to attachment the detail and here change the z duration to 25 click ok and now double click in the section and here we change the dimension of this sketch we change 60 to 45 and now close this sketch okay and now select this section 3 and click on mouse and go to attachment to detail and here change the z duration to 50 click ok double click in this section and what we'll do here is to delete this sketch select this sketch delete and now go to the cycle tool and do this cycle go to select this tool and select this cycle and change the diameter to 5 click close okay so so now what we'll do is to select this first sketch and go to this love tool click in this icon and here we click in this add session option and add these all sections okay that's okay and you can see that we have this part here okay so now select this face create new sketch and here you use the cycle tool and draw the cycle pick this tool and constrain the diameter of this cycle to oh, 25 click close go to pocket tool and here you change the type to true wall yes press ok and now we'll chamfer the edge of these cycles. So let's select this edge and go to this tool, chamfer tool. Pressing this edge option and select this edge and now press OK. Select this face, create new sketch. And here you go to the center the rectangle tool and draw this rectangle use this vertical distance to constrain the limit of this line to 5 per center 
and close the sketch and now go to pocket tool change the type to toggle and now press ok so again select this face and grip the sketch in here pressing this icon use this tool to extract this the edge of this part okay and now clicking this top face go to cycle tool and draw this cycle so now close the sketch and go to pocket tool in here we'll change the to the five so as you can see we have this pocket now close this now select this face again with new sketch clicking this is much view choose this tool and extract again this edge and now switch to top face and here select the cycle tool and draw this cycle and now use this tool and constrain the diameter of the cycle to Ten. Close the sketch. Go to pocket tool, and here you change to travel again. So okay, we have this pocket. Press OK. And now select this edge and go to fillet tool. Clicking this icon. Press OK. And now we will select this fillet, this pocket tree, this pocket tool and go to the polar pattern tool clicking this icon so here we go to the number of occurrence and change it to four so as you can see we have the fillets in the pockets done so now press ok so if you want to make this part look, look like this Part. follow these steps select this edge then click on mouse and go to appearance and here go to gold double click here and drag this arrow to this top press ok and decrease these values and press close ok then I'll go to the part rock bench. Okay, so select this first face and click in this icon, and again select this face. And here, click in this. And here we change to white color. Press OK. And now select this face, this four face. Click here. And here we change the color to okay, maybe this color. Click OK. Click OK. And as you can see, this part is is looking as this part so now what is missing is to add these lengths as you can see okay we can do that going to the render workbench and here we select this icon click in this icon and you add a line to the preview select this Line and click on mouse and choose transform option and here we can drag this line okay you can add more lines clicking this icon select this line and then click on mouse and go to transform option and drag this line
local so if you can if you want to order or if you want to group these lines you can use this icon create a group click on this icon and here you will select these two lines and drag it to the group folder okay so if you select this group and press press bar you can hide the, the lines okay so thank you to watch this video